I'm Therese. Welcome back. I'm so glad that you guys are here. Welcome to a day of organizing our Christmas decorations. I've actually broke down this year and bought some bins and I'm really excited to share my tricks and tips with you guys. It is really cold here in Chicago. I have a lot of videos coming up. So I would really love it if you would think about subscribing and hit that notification bell and be a part of the family so yeah the snow just keeps coming it is so beautiful but uh, I've had to actually go out and shovel the snow quite a few times this year the kids actually love it they literally sit there at the window and watch the snow come down so yeah, this is what we're starting with. What a mess. So we're trading in the boxes for some bins. And we're going to start with our kitchen tier. And I'm actually going to save some red items for decorating for Valentine's Day. And yeah, this is the bin that I bought. I'm not putting any labels on them because they're clear and I can pretty much see what is in them. So what I'm doing is all of the kitchen tier items I'm putting all in one bin anything that was on my kitchen table for decor is going to go in and I'm actually putting my cups in there as well I was going to put them in a cabinet but my cabinets it's getting pretty full of these cups for each of the holidays and Barbie's always supervising <laughs> so if you just put them um next to something that's really soft you ha don't have to worry about wrapping them and then you know you can save on paper so yeah we're just going to go ahead and put everything in one bin and now I am putting away all of the potpourri. I'm putting it all in one big, huge plastic bag. And I'm going to actually wrap my little snowman and put it all in one bag. So this way, all you have to do is just open one bag and you're done. And you're ready for next year. And my kitchen lights for the holiday I'm actually putting in a drawer believe it or not I actually <laughs> I actually cleaned that drawer out so I'm able to get more items in there and yeah Barbie just loves going along for the ride she's so cute and now we're gonna take everything off of the tree I'm actually putting all of my big items in one pile and taking all of the Christmas ornaments and putting them in one bin. And of course there is Barbie to supervise. So yeah, all of the big items are going to be put on the floor. I haven't decided if I'm putting them in a box or if I'm gonna put them in bags because they are too big for the bins. And actually I don't know if there's any bins out there that would actually fit all of those huge items.
taking all of the items away from around the mantle. And uh, yeah, Barbie really did a number on this Christmas tree. She knocked it over several times. And then we're going to put all of our pillows in bags. Because otherwise probably two would fit like in each bin. And then all of the stocking holders, instead of wrapping them, we're just going to put them in each corner of the bin and just make sure that you take out the batteries. And we're going to put him away in this bin as well and he actually fits. But I, of course I placed him in a plastic bag and then we have one more light to put away. And also the coordinating ornament that goes into the powder room is going to go in the same drawer. And this, I'm going to recycle. It's plastic and I would rather have a glass one. And then next, we are going... Coco says hello. Coco, honey, we're filming. Thank you. So next up, we are taking everything from the entrance and putting it in one bin. Again... Just make sure you take out all of the batteries. And yeah, actually everything fit all in one bin. And as you can see, Hello Kitty back there and that sign, we're putting that in one big box with all of our tall Christmas trees because they will not fit in a bin. Coco, you are very talkative today, honey. So yeah, this way, when you reach for this bin next year, you'll know everything that goes in the entranceway. And of course, we kept out a few items for Christmas. My little trees I like to keep out. Yeah, and we're done. So yeah, this is what we started with. A mess. All my pillows in bags if you guys have a better idea please put that in the comments below so i'm still waiting for the christmas tree bag to come in the mail i can put each section in a bag and then put it back in the box in the garage so we'll go ahead and put the christmas tree back in the box and then over here i do have some large items that i did have to go ahead and put in this huge box and we're still in the process of collecting our elves. And uh, yeah, our big items right here, we'll probably just put them in a bag and actually that'll work out very well. And up here, I'm still gonna go ahead and take a couple of these items down and we went ahead and left the lights up for all year. And right now, this is what I do have up for the fireplace. Yes, Coco. <laughs> And I still have quite a few bins left over. Um, I have about four left over, which is actually really good. I'm surprised. And then right over in here, I didn't have a choice. Um, I did have to use this because these trees are so big. I think this is the best purchase I have made this year for organizing. And then right over here, we have ornaments in each of the boxes is like one is from the hallway one is from the fireplace one is like christmas decorations and then we do have the lights yes it's true so actually it turned out so well and i feel a lot more organized Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell because you will be the first to be notified of my future videos. And I will see you guys really soon. Mwah! XO.